Nutrition is the hallmark of good health, and pairing nutrition with an active lifestyle and educating our children on those values, I believe, can really change the face of the disease in the future. My name is Monica Joyce. I'm a registered dietitian nutritionist, and I'm a certified diabetes educator. Helping people with diabetes has been my lifelong mission for almost 40 years. I'm the founder and director of Slam Dunk for Diabetes. Slam Dunk for Diabetes is the only day basketball camp in the country, and we provide the opportunity for children with prediabetes and type 1 and type 2 diabetes to get together, play ball, and to learn to manage their diabetes. Many stories of the Slam Dunk kids have stuck with me throughout the years. I think one of the most special stories is that of Olivia's. My name is Olivia Villarreal and I was diagnosed with diabetes when I was 11 years old. Uh, when I was first diagnosed with diabetes, I felt very alone. I felt like it was just handed to me in the world. I think Olivia was feeling quite lonely with the disease and overwhelmed by the diagnosis of diabetes. I didn't know that children could get it, so I felt like it was super unfair and that I would have nobody to talk to about it. Diabetes is a lonely disease for a child. I remember one little boy came and he walked into the gym. There were 75 children with diabetes and he turned to his mom and he said, Mom, do all of those children have diabetes like me? So I think rather than feeling isolated, they feel normal for this camp week. When I first got to the camp, it wasn't just like, oh, it's so sad, all the kids have diabetes. It wasn't like that at all. It was happiness. It was kids laughing and running and playing, and I wanted to be a part of that so much. And I think coming back year after year, what Olivia learned is that she really isn't alone. I view my life differently now because I no longer felt alone anymore. I saw all the little kids uh, with diabetes just like me. With good exercise and good nutrition, diabetes can get easier and it's not as hard and it's not as scary and life can be long lived. What's most rewarding to me is to see the camaraderie that develops on that court, the friendships that are built. She created a world for diabetic kids to play and be normal and have fun and meet people and meet other kids that have diabetes. I can't thank her enough for everything she did. I met Olivia in 2004 and I said to people, stick around, Olivia is going to set the world on fire one day. And I think uh, Olivia has really been a marvelous, uh, an example of what camp can do for children. Slam Dunk!